Hello, this is Jose, and this is the video tutorial for week six. And for this week, I just want to go through on how to create a walkthrough um, in the floor plan. And so I have this floor plan. It's really basic. I don't have anything on it. I don't have any components on it, really. But it's the main purpose is just to show you the process of how to create a walkthrough. Um, so if you have the the floor plan open you would go to view and this icon where it says 3d view you click the down arrow and then select walkthrough and then pretty much once you select that you will be able to create, create the keyframes or the path that you want the camera to follow um, so I'm just gonna go throughout the entire floor plan here and I'm gonna start clicking so each click will be one keyframe, so you can create as many keyframes as you want. I'm just going to go in here in these rooms. Do a little circle. And get out. Go into what would be the living room. And then go into the garage. And then I'm actually going to go back just to get a view of the kitchen here. And then just end right there. Um, and once you're done, you just click finish walkthrough. It looks a little bit like a mess, but you, um, you select it. And then you would go to edit walkthrough. And then this is where you can go to each keyframe. Um, so you can, if you want to view the walkthrough, the path that you just created, you just click uh, open walkthrough right here. And I believe this is the last one. So you can just go back to the first keyframe where it all starts. And you can also just select, put the number of keyframe that you want to go to there um, are you? yeah and so um, I do not so I go back to edit walkthrough and if I want to see everything just click, click play and I'll just take you through the path that you created And I'm just going to click escape out of here and then just I'm gonna stop this. But uh, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much the, the process that you go through in creating the walkthrough. And then you can play around with the settings here. And um, you can select on the frame settings and then you can change the total frames. Um, if you want better resolution, you can double that or increase the number of total frames. Um, you can also go specifically to each keyframe and then maybe slow down the specific keyframe that you want more detail to be seen or anything like that. Um, but um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the tutorial for for this week and um, I hope it was helpful.